That report, you know that rally coming just hours after protesters gathered in Emancipation Park to stand in solidarity with Atlanta. 27-year-old Rayshard Brooks was shot and killed Friday night by an officer just outside of Wendy's there. Meantime, here in Houston, protesters called for policy changes locally and nationally to end police brutality. Several new developments today in the investigation into Rayshard Brooks' death. The officer who shot Brooks, Garrett Rolfe, seen here, has been fired. The Fulton County DA saying a decision on charges could come by Wednesday. The result of Brooks's autopsy released this evening, listing his cause of death as two gunshot wounds to the back. The manner of death listed as homicide. Body camera video of the deadly incident was released overnight. Brooks was being taken into custody after failing a field sobriety test in the parking lot of a Wendy's. After a scuffle with officers, he grabbed a taser and ran off. The officers ran after him and Rolf shot Brooks in the back. If that shot was fired for some reason other than to save that officer's life or to prevent injury to him or others, then that shooting is not justified under the law. The second officer involved in the shooting, Devin Brosnan, has been placed on administrative duty. We have more of this developing story right now on our website. Click to Houston.com.